six P. Man, his anti airs and jabs have been so clean so far. Yeah, for real. I gotta ask you, man, how you feel about this cornball reset that these souls been doing, bro? With the banner of over one hit into the command throw. It's not very good. Uh, yeah. It's not very real. Ugh. You can hit a button, you can jump. Uh, you gotta save it for like the final hour. That's what I'm saying, bro. So with Red Bull Kumite having been this past weekend and Soul Player showing off some new things that he can do this patch, I think it's time some people understand that there is one particular thing that you should not let Soul Players get away with for free. With the new patch, Soul gained the ability to choose when to do the second hit of Bandit Revolver or not to do it at all. This has opened up both new routes and a potential new mix-up. At Red Bull Kumite, both Bon Bon and Skill showed off that Soul can hit you with one hit of Bandit Revolver and then attempt to go for a throw afterwards. However, I'm here to tell you that you shouldn't allow this to happen to you for free for a few reasons. Taking a look at the frame data on single hit bandit revolver, you'll notice that it is punishable both on hit or block if there is no cancel into the second hit. Specifically, on hit, it's negative four, making only throws and three frame buttons able to punish it. This means that the attempts that soul players use at throwing you after getting hit by bandit revolver are actually a moment where they should probably be the ones to get thrown. If you're a solar chip player, you can hit your three frame buttons who also attempt to punish. This is where Soul can play the RPS game with you and do delayed second hit, even on hit, to try and catch your attempt at punishing it. Now, on block, the setup is a little trickier, as while the move is more negative than on hit at negative seven, if Soul delay cancels it on block, it can become a frame trap that can be comboed off of. One of the best things that you can do if you're worried that the Soul player is going to delay the second hit though, is use your character's respective 6P. Due to 6P's removing the upper part of your hurt box, Bandit Revolver cannot go low enough to actually hit you, and you'll counter hit Soul. If Soul doesn't do the second hit and is close enough, he can either decide to go for throw, assuming that you're going to 6P, or he can go for Volcanic Viper to invul through. Despite that though, you still want to try and represent that the Soul player cannot just frame trap you for free. Depending on your character, you may also be able to cover both single and delayed Bandit Revolver by hitting a button that also low profiles. Great examples of this are Axel 2K, Ramlethal 2K, and Jacko 2K. It's kind of a pattern. While not every character has a catch-all safe option on block, like Axel 2K versus Revolver, it's still important to make a soul player think on offense whenever you can. In fact, I believe Faust is the only character that has a catch-all safe option to go to when the first hit of Revolver actually hits you, with Faust super into PRC. Most invincible moves in this game aren't exactly safe, so they're not the perfect option, but much like everything else in fighting games, they are still an option that you must remember. So don't be afraid to use them, even if they don't cover everything. Well, I hope this helps everybody deal with the situation a little bit better to not let those pesky souls continue to get away with these resets. Not everything is a catch-all, and Soul does have options to be able to make this a lot harder for the defender, but at the very least, now you know how this works, and you can start to lab it yourself, which I highly encourage. If you guys like the content here today, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz that every YouTuber tells you to do. But also, hey, I stream over on my Twitch channel at twitch.tv slash EbonicPlayBB, so you're not only going to get content similar to this over there, but you're also going to get to see a lot of Soul Bad Guy related stuff, and other games, of course, because I am a multifaceted fighting game player and commentator.